Today is May 28th, the Feast of St. Augustine of Canterbury. Readings are going to come from 1 Timothy 2, 2-9, and Luke 10, 1-9. And so let us begin. In nomine Patris, Filii, et Spiritus Sancti. Amen. From the second letter of Blessed Paul the Apostle to Timothy. And the things which thou hast heard of me by many witnesses, the same commend to faithful men who shall be fit to teach others also. Labor as a good soldier of Christ. No man, being a soldier to God, entangleth himself with secular businesses, that he may please him to whom he hath engaged himself. For he also that striveth for the mastery is not crowned, except he strive lawfully. The husbandman that laboreth must first partake of the fruits. Understand what I say, for the Lord will give thee in all things understanding. Be mindful that the Lord Jesus Christ is risen again from the dead of the seed of David, according to my gospel, wherein I labor even unto bands as an evildoer. But the word of God is not bound. Deo gratias. Continuation of the Holy Gospel according to St. Luke. Gloria tibi Domine. And after these things, the Lord appointed also other seventy-two, and he sent them two and two before his face into every city and place whither he himself was to come. And he said to them, The harvest indeed is great, but the laborers are few. Pray ye therefore the Lord of the harvest that he send laborers into his harvest. Go, behold, I send you as lambs among wolves. Carry neither purse nor scrip nor shoes, and salute no man by the way. Into whatsoever house you enter, first say, Peace be to this house. And if the Son of Peace be there, your peace shall rest upon him. But if not, it shall return to you. And in the same house remain, eating and drinking such things as they have. For the laborer is worthy of his hire. Remove not from house to house, and into what city soever you enter, and they receive you. Eat such things as are set before you, and heal the sick that are therein, and say to them, The kingdom of God is come nigh unto you. Laus tibi Christe. Christ.